the curse they did over you has come back to bite them. Somebody could have sacrificed you or somebody could have sacrificed their divine counterparts. Spirit's letting me know something like they sacrificed someone for a false person. This false person could have been doing some kind of curse or something. So it's come back around on them. Bring in love, Arche of Charity, and Arche of Faith, number one and number 19. This could be something about your confidence. There may be some kind of achievement here. You guys may be involved with someone from the past or someone from a past life. Helpful people. Someone may be trying to help you. personal power and there's something about change okay yeah the curse is done or there's a change now you're feeling more powerful Intervention and purpose. There's some kind of intervention. The divine director. Divine intervention is occurring. Know that you are being guided. Happiness is your purpose. <clears throat> Excuse me. Passion. Passion and action is trying to come out. Do what excites you. Get fired up about your life. Increase your energy levels. And then action. Now is the perfect time to take action. Take inspired action towards your dreams. Move forward with confidence. So here's some more confidence energy. You're going to be doing something soon. And you're going to need to have confidence with this. Someone is going to help you or you're going to help someone. New beginnings. Someone's trying to stop this, though. This is coming out sideways. This is judgment. Something is nearing the end or wrapping up. You're about to start a new life or finding your purpose. A forgiving and compassionate review of the past. Archangel Jeremy. Whoever had a curse over you, they don't want you to start a new life. You guys maybe see the numbers 47 a lot. 
47 or you guys could be 47. Spirit's letting me know something about restored health. Someone has restored health. Or there's some kind of healing with your health. Some of you guys are getting ready to receive a message. Okay, the curse they did over you has come back to bite them. Tower reversed. Yeah. They're trying to prevent something, stop something. Stop the, they're trying to stop the inevitable. The universe is ultimately going to let something um, destruct. And we already see how divine intervention is occurring right now. So they can't stop or stop some change or some personal power of yours or something with bringing, bringing in love or some kind of help. <clears throat> Excuse me. They may not want you associating with someone or talking with someone, some curse. The sun. <clears throat> Excuse me. Some some curse got exposed or revealed or you found something out. There's about to be a lot more happiness in your life. The lovers. Yeah, this is about love. Maybe something about a soulmate. Eight of Wands, something is happening possibly quickly. There's some kind of breakthrough. You broke out of a curse. This could be you and someone else that broke out of a curse or you and your soulmate that broke out of a curse. Someone may be trying to make sure you guys are not happy together. They may be trying to make sure someone doesn't come into union. They're trying to stop these soulmates. The moon, it's like a secret curse. Four of Wands, Page of Swords. Yeah, you found something out. There's going to be some kind of message, call, text, letter. You guys are, or you guys are in union, or or about to be in union, or something about a party, a celebration achievements you may have your spirit team working with you or some other people helping you some helpful people someone may be trying to hide something or hide communication seven of wands reversed i feel like someone's trying to to lower your vibration or bring you down or trying to have you quit or stop something. They may not want you to keep going. They may not want you to, to have protection or feel safe or protected. Some of you guys, you've been looking for some kind of sign. This is the sign you've been looking for. Seven of Cups, Four Cups Reversed. Someone is trying to have you and the soulmate confused about each other or about something, possibly about your emotions or feelings about a situation or about each other. But you're aware of this, though. You're aware that someone's doing this. They're trying to have you in a confused mindset Somebody wants you to think your soulmate is against you or like they want you to think your soulmate is trying to harm you or has some hidden motives. They want you to not trust them. They want you to think something like they're out to get you or something. That's not, that's not what's going on. It's some, someone else possibly. Someone's ready to be happy with you. Some of y'all are definitely going to get a, a message or call very soon or very quickly. 
there's some incoming uh, news or letter. You guys are overcoming or avoiding getting away from some kind of chaos or destruction. This may be someone that wants to seize the opportunity with you and be happy. Or maybe they want to get back together. Devil reversed. Two of swords reversed. Two of cups coming out sideways. Yeah, someone's trying to, trying to have you and your soulmate conflicted about each other. They're trying to have the blindfold over both of y'all. You guys are supposed to fear each other or look at each other like enemies, but it's not working. It's some kind of curse. Lovers, message of concern. Some of you guys could have received a message from a lover or your soulmate or from someone, someone significant. either did or you are or you are going to they could have they could have said they um was concerned or they they needed help from you or they could have said something someone's concerned or something with a message yeah message there's a message here you guys have been messaging each other i feel like your soulmate may need help Marriage. This could involve a marriage or a relationship. Despair reversed. It was more with some message or message of concern, possibly. They love you. Someone loves you. They're trying to get them to forget about you. So someone loves you. They're trying to get that person to forget about you. They beat themselves up for how they treated you. Emergency room. Somebody could have went to the emergency room. Somebody could be holding on to resentments. Someone may be trying to delay you guys coming together. And something about divine union. Somebody's about to surrender. Whoever's got this curse on you guys or doing some magic, they're about to have to surrender. Divine intervention. Don't let them kill your vibe. Someone wants to come back to you. Someone's going to ask you out very soon. They're possibly going to message you or call you and ask you out. Something about a custody battle or some kind of battle. You don't have to act like a stranger. Someone's trying to get their sugar daddy to pay for butt implants. <laughs> well, Someone may need help with something with a house, a home. Okay, what else? Some curse. Collaboration. This could be a group of people that was working together to do some kind of curse. Collaboration. Or that could be the energy where someone needs uh, help or support. Or they're concerned. 
is something with partnership here. Friendship. This is coming out reversed. This could have been a group or a group of friends that had some kind of curse over you guys. What is this curse supposed to be doing? Collaboration, friendship? This could be supposed to be messing with your beliefs. It's something with your perception. 35. They're trying to mess with your perception. They're trying to have you in the seven of cups. Like confused and stuff about your feelings or how you're perceiving the other person, how you're perceiving your soulmate, or how like um how they how they're perceiving you. The frequency of perception supports our natural curiosity, moving us beyond be, beyond our comfort zone. They're letting me know something like the worst is is behind you. So you're moving past your comfort zone to find the edges of what you perceive as real and to take a good hard look deep a deep hard look at it so they want y'all's perception so the which y'all's perception with you and your soulmate what are they trying to do to their perception they don't want them to recognize something or be rewarded. Recognition and reward reversed. This is the three of pentacles reversed. They don't want you guys involved with each other or helping each other or being helpful. They don't want you guys trusting each other or collaborating with each other. They don't want you guys being in unity. I feel like it's something like they don't want you guys in general being in a union or something. If your soulmate's been messaging you, they could be trying to confuse them. Like once they get the message, they're trying to confuse them or something. Is that something here? Wow. Devil reverse the moon. So whatever that energy is. Okay, yeah, you guys, three cups just came out. Rejoice in celebration. Some truth is out. You guys are about to be celebrating something, or you are. You guys are going to help each other. You are going to be happy. You are going to stay in union or are going to ce um, celebrate or reunite. This is some kind of truth. The universe is revealed to someone. I'm seeing something like, someone's reaching out to a soulmate or messaging them and then some devil energy is trying to confuse them once they receive the message to mess with their perception These friends or some group is collaborating together doing some kind of curse for you guys' perception to be messed up. That's ending the transformation, the waiting game. This was hidden. Scorpio energy. It was something hidden. Something mysterious or um, secret or something energetically was going on. They, they're possibly trying to have you guys waiting at a standstill, going around in a loop, going around in circles, or somebody just going around and around this this sand clock, this little time clock thing. But now something's changing. Some secrets are being revealed, it looks like. Excuse me. This curse came back to bite these friends or some group. It's like you guys are protected or covered. Someone wants to apologize to you. Yeah, it's something like they're trying to block communication. They could be trying to block the telepathic communication. I've been telepathically communicating with you. They're trying to get them to reject you or turn you down. 
if if you're trying to reach out to your soulmate and they're not responding or not answering the phone or something, don't take that personally. They want them to think that you're crazy. They cannot stand the silence between you. Their world has been cold without you. And somebody, someone may be recovering from something. Show us more with this curse or something with their perception. It's like. It's kind of like they want you to look at your soulmate through a false lens or some rose-colored glasses, kind of, is what I'm sensing. Like, they want you to look at your soulmate in a negative light. They're trying to get you guys both to do this. Yeah, doubts. They're trying to have you guys having doubts. Doubts. They want you guys to doubt something or doubt each other doubts the connection maybe they could want you to release each other there's some kind of grounding going on or something okay show us more with this perception what they're doing with some curves or something Someone's in regret. Someone realizes something that was hidden behind this moon. There's a sun and the moon. Someone's in regret. This could have been happening in the past. I know that I cannot change the past. There's some kind of communication blockages. Someone's doing something or, or telling them something so that they don't communicate or message you or be concerned or something. They don't want them. They're trying to fool them with regards to you. Full reverse. They don't want this person talking to you. They're trying to block out some kind of... Um, they're trying to block something with their, their mind or some kind of mental blocks. Some of you guys, they don't want this person to believe you. They don't want them to protect you. They're trying to stop some beginning or... Yeah, Ace of Swords communication just came out they're trying to block out communication that's changing though something massive is about to happen between you and your soulmate there's divine intervention here and someone's possibly going to take action and you guys are going to have a new beginning or a new life with this judgment. 